everyone, it's Autumn. Today I wanted to go ahead and film the December Allure Beauty Box unboxing. Um, I didn't film an unboxing for this beauty box that I received in the mail randomly, so just kind of to, to explain to you how I came about being a subscriber of this. Um, because I would have really never had subscribed to this. This used to be called like Sample Society. I'm what you call like um, Allure... Um, what do they call it? Beauty enthusiasts. So you can join their email and they kind of like send you stuff and that's how you get um, alerted to those big Allure beauty boxes that I sometimes get during the um, like the spring and they have them in the fall. I haven't done them in a while because I have such a back stock in my closet but sometimes they come out for, for like $50 you can get those really big boxes of products that value over like $200 or so. And so I haven't done those in a while, but I still do get the email alerts. And I got an email alert from beauty enthusiasts a while back saying, um, like, you have a box on the way or something like that. And I didn't know what they were talking about or they wanted to verify my address or something. And so I just verified my address and then all of a sudden I had a beauty box, like an editor's pick of the Allure, like small beauty box like this that popped up in my mail last month. I didn't do an unboxing because I then went and I checked and it wasn't an actual like monthly beauty box. It, like it wasn't November's beauty box. It was um, just like random um, things from like l past month's beauty boxes. So I had like a Tatcha um, body cream in it and it, I came, it came with like this eyeshadow as well which is um, which I have tried out and I do like. It's by this brand. I don't know if it's called like Doucet or something, but it's their Freematic eyeshadow. And I guess eventually you can get a couple of these and you start clicking them together and it creates like this palette or something. Um, so I did get one of those and I got some other things in that box. So then after I got that box, I didn't think much else of it. I, I was not going to subscribe. But then I got another email after I got the box asking me how I liked the box. And then they offered me um, for $10 a month, I could subscribe to the box. And then for four months, and then if I continued to not like the box after that, um, then I could unsubscribe or then it would go to $15 a month. So I decided to just go ahead, subscribe for four months, and I figured I would include and do these videos and just see if I thought it was worth it. I'm going to go ahead and do these videos just like I do my derm store unboxings where I see what the value of the box is, I'll put the information on the video and all that good stuff. I'll also link to the products in the description box as well. So I'm going to go ahead and get into it. Like I mentioned, that this is the December box. It comes with a little booklet telling you more about the products as well. So I'm going to go ahead and um, talk about the theme. I'm not going to read the whole thing here to you, but the theme of this box is dry skin and just kind of getting that glow, that winter glow into the skin. I'm going to go in order in the booklet as well. The very first thing you get is a hand cream. And this is the Coastal Salt and Heavenly Hand Cream. And you get depending on um, just which box you get, they randomly give you either a choice of three different hand creams. I happen to get the scent Ocean Garden Gardenia, and you get an ounce of hand cream. Um, and then so what it is, it says a fast absorbing hand cream. What it does, hydrates, softens, and scents skin. The key ingredients are shea butter, avocado oil, jojoba oil, cucumber, and aloe leaf extracts. And it says how it looks, feels, smells. The non-greasy formula comes in three scents, which I already mentioned. Um, so the scent I got, let me see their description. It says it is sweet, tart, and almost candy-like. So let's just test it out. I like that it's small, like purse size, so I probably will stick this in my purse. And it's not one of those metal ones to where if you accidentally bend it, it starts like squeezing out the side of the tube. Um, So we will do that. I also like getting these small $10 boxes because if you think about it, even if you don't use the products in here, like this would be perfect to include like in a little gift basket if you just start saving these things. 
putting them to the side. You can make gift baskets around the holidays or birthdays and stuff for friends and family. That is actually almost candy-like. Okay. Okay, and says why we like it. There are hand creams that you would buy when your skin is severely dry and cracked. And then there are hand creams that you would buy just because they look nice in a guest bathroom. This formula is both intensely nourishing and impressively good looking. The price is $10 each. Where to buy it? CoastalSaltAndSoul.com. And it says your box will contain one of the three cents. Okay, um, and then again, I will have if this one retails for 10 or if this is just like a sample size. So I'll let you know. All right, next item is this European Wax Center Oh My Brow Brow Highlighter. Oh My Brow, okay. Oh My Brow Brow Highlighter. There was like no punctuation between that, so it's not, oh yeah, there is on the box though. All right, and this is in the shade Pearl. <coughs> that smell is getting to me. Woo! All right, so it says it's a crayon highlighter. The champagne colored crayon is firm but creamy, and they like it. Technically, the purpose of this crayon is to highlight your brow bone and show off your perfectly groomed arches, but honestly, this luminizer is so freaking pretty, we thought, why stop there? Swipe it over your cheeks and blend it with your fingers for a perfect, not too shimmery sheen. Dab it on the inner corners of your eyes um, to make them look brighter. And if you're really feeling it, go ahead and tap some on your cupid's bow for a little um, subtle lip plumping effect. Price $19. So I'm guessing that this is a full size. All right, so. All right, so here is the product and I will go ahead and swatch it there for you and so I have makeup everywhere I don't have anything on my cupid's bow so I'll go ahead and I'll put some there like it suggests I'm not really a cupid bow highlighter person um, and it does seem to blend out pretty easily Although, I kind of just blended it in with my chapstick and it kind of burned my lips a little bit. Maybe that was a fluke. That's weird. Hmm. Okay. And then, I think it looks like it has a dual end. Like, yeah. And then it's got this to help you blend it out. If, like, you put some up on your brow and you need to blend that out a little bit. So that's cool. And it's a, it seems, yes, and it's a twist up. So that's cool. So yeah, it retails for 19 and it comes with a little, is that a booklet in there? Yeah, it comes with a little booklet. Okay, and it shows you how to do your brows, I guess. That's weird. Shows you how to fill in your eyebrows. Um, just in case you didn't know how to do that. Um, all right. So that's the second product in there. Okay. Third product is the Tula Advanced Neck Cream. Um, all right. I was looking for a jar because the picture shows a jar. Um, but this right here is what you get. So this is a rich, supremely hydrating cream. It helps to prevent crepey skin, horizontal lines, and premature aging. The ingredients um, in this are patented probiotic, complex shea butter, jojoba seed oil, and safflower, safflower seed oil, vitamin C and E, and turmeric. Um, how it looks, feels, smells. Though they call it a cream, it's definitely thicker and more balm-like. They like it because the um, you don't need to a separate cream just for your neck, but owning one is likely to make you pay more attention to the region. After using this treatment diligently for six months, we can attest to smoother, tighter, and more swan-like neck. Um, I need a neck cream because if you see here, I've got some like neck, you know, lines in my neck. So maybe this will be nice for me. Um, the price for the full size is $80, so I'll have to do like some math. You do get half an ounce. It doesn't say what the full size, um, 
size is, so I'm going to have to do some digging to see, you know, some research or whatever to see what a full size one is. So that's pretty cool to try out. All right, next product here is the Embryolise Le Creme Concentrate, and they give you a just a little sample of it, five milliliters, and this is going to be perfect for flying for me um, because it is so moisturizing. I have a full size of this, and I like it a lot. I have it like the anniversary, like gold edition, which I. I've gone through quite a bit of it. Um, I'll probably need a new one here in the next couple of months, but I really do love this stuff. Um, but what they say about it here, it's a fast absorbing face moisturizer. Paraben free cream hydrates the skin without interfering with makeup. Key ingredient, shea butter, beeswax, aloe vera, and soy proteins. Um, how it looks, feels, smells. Milky white cream is not heavy or oily and it is unscented and why they like it. It's a favorite of makeup artists, so we'll allow them to sing its praises. You massage it in and the skin takes on a beautiful tone without looking greasy. Um, says makeup artist Raphael Pitta or Pita. Um, Kristen Galagos, a makeup artist who's worked with Karen Elson and Agnes Dane adds it's the best moisturizer. Um, price is $28 for 75 milliliters. So they give you only, what, five milliliters? So this isn't, yeah, this isn't worth hardly anything um, because $28 for um, 75, that's not very much money. All right. And then they give us a beauty blender, liquid blender cleanser. And it's $30 for 10 ounces, but they give us, I don't even know if this says how, um, sample size, but where does it say how much is in this? I don't even think the size is marked on this, unless I'm just blind. This isn't very big, it just says sample size, not for resale. The size is even marked on this. Um... I'll have to compare it to some things. I don't even think this is a full ounce. This might be maybe a half ounce. I'll have to compare it to some things to see. Um, this may not even be a half ounce. This might be a third of an ounce. But anyway, they gave us that and it just says it's a soy based cleanser that removes foundation, grime and bacteria from your makeup. Um, it says it's low suds liquid that has a subtle lavender scent. And um, yeah. We all know about that. I have used it. I don't think it's the best thing to clean be my beauty blenders. Um, I still don't think that it gets them 100% clean, and I use Zilch soap actually to clean my beauty blenders. However, I will travel with this to clean my makeup brushes if I want to give them a deep cleanse because I think that this does a great job on makeup brushes themselves. So this is going to be something perfect for travel to clean makeup brushes. So I'm perfectly fine with getting that. Um, and then the last thing here in the box is this Kevin Murphy Anti-Gravity Oil-Free Volumizer. And it's a lightweight volumizing serum. It boosts volume all over without weighing hair down. Um, and then it has some ingredients in it that I can't really pronounce. Um, um, polyacrylamide. It's supposed to thicken um, uh, cop... What is it? Copolymer copolymer and I don't know PVP um, another polymer uh, prevent frizz hold style it's got lavender flower water uh, which is an astringent honey extract which softens uh, it's a colorless milky serum that smells like lemonade infused with lavender the um, formula is sticky enough going on that we wanted to wash our hands immediately so it's supposed to be pretty sticky um, why we like it. Most volumizers are meant to be applied at the roots to lift, to provide lift, something that isn't ideal if your fine hair is also greasy. Hmm. The serum is meant to be raked through the length of your hair so you get significant bulk without even approaching the little oil derricks on your scalp. Hmm. So the price is $27.50. Um, and I can see here in the full size of it, it looks like it's 5.1 fluid ounces and then this little sample right here is 1.4 fluid ounces 
So it's a good little sample. Let me see if I can smell that. Yeah, I can smell the lemon and the lavender. So that is really interesting. And it's not like that candy lemon. It's like straight up like lemon juice lemon. So um, really interesting. So that is everything in this box. I paid 10 um, but again, if you don't have the deal or whatever, which sign up for Allure Beauty Enthusiasts. Um, I'll try to figure out a way to sign up for it and I'll leave all that information below because they do send you deals and stuff all the time. Um, I'll just put all the info below. Again, I don't get anything. They have no idea who I am, but I just thought that that would be interesting for you guys to try out if you wanted to try it out. And I'll have all the products and all that good stuff linked. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye!